boys and girls, uh, we're out on the field. Uh, we forgot to bring our cameras, so we're using our foot on my phone instead. We're back out again, guys. So, yeah, we're back out. Just for you. We're on one of our permissions, so. It's a not, lovely morning. It is a lovely morning. Look at that, sunshine. Uh, we're just going to have a quick. I've got a few, a few hours. Yeah, a few hours out and see what we'll find. Yeah. Uh, we're going on one of our old newest permissions we got. Yeah, but. On a field that we've never been on to, so. All also, we can do is try, innit, James? Well, that's it. That's all we can do. So we'll catch you on the first hole. Bye for now. On the next. Hi, right, guys, here we go. It's down here. It's a little one, lad. It's down the coin, but it's completely battered. Oh. Uh. Yeah, it's completely battered. Uh, there's writing on it, but I can't Let's have a lead, James. Let's give it to Paul. So you can Paul see. It's not brought me loot, so I can't really tell what it is. There's only writing on it. Need close inspection, that. Yep. We give it a clean up and we'll see what it is. We're gonna go home. Right, we'll catch you on the next one. Alright boys and girls, Paul's got a target and he thinks it's a bullet. It's definitely a bullet. Oh it's definitely a bullet. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's definitely a bullet, mate. You know what this means, James? <laughs> You could win one of these guys in our next year's competitions. Bullet in the box. There you go. First find in this box. <laughs> Catch on next. As brought to you by Regtons. Go there for all your money needs. Anything about detecting? Go and see Nigel and Marcus at Regtons. Use Jim Disc. 10% off everything. So yeah, brought to you by Jim and Paul. Right boys and girls, I uh, dug a target and I found this. Uh, it could be something, it could be nothing, but Martin found something like that. And it turned out to be a Roman stylus. So, if you're watching this Martin, if you've got any ideas, if it could be one, please let me know. Right, Paul's got a target over there, so I'm going to nip over to him now. So I'll catch you when I get over there to him. Boys and girls, it was the tiniest piece of lead you could ever see. <laughs> right, we'll catch you on the next hole. Bye for now. Well, hello, boys and girls. We have another target. Don't know what it is. Don't care. Just a find. Oh, yeah. Not got a clue. Right, we'll catch you on the next one. Hello boys and girls, it's been a while. Uh, we've not really had many targets. What targets we did have were hot rocks. It's absolute garbage. Yes, it's not been very good. But, I just we dug this one, this. and we just found this. Uh, let's get you in focus. Uh, we're not too sure what that is. It's square, it's heavy. Got a line in the top there. I thought it were a printing block, but it's not. So yeah, any ideas, guys? Oh, right. Yeah. Put any hand for that, mate. Yeah, no idea what it is. If anyone got a clue, please leave a comment below. I right, catch you on the next hole. Well, boys and girls, it's a piece of an old buckle. Uh, I'll try and get it in focus so you can see. Yeah, just a bit of an old buckle. Right, catch you on the next one. Paul's got a target there. So, we'll probably see what you got in a little while. Catch you in a minute. Right, Paul's got a target and it's a square piece of lead. Best signal I've had all day. Yeah, been getting a lot of hot rocks. 
Yeah, just a piece of that, guys. And I'll catch you on the next one. On to the next. Well, boys and girls, I have a target here. Paul's got it in his hands because he just cleaned it up for me. And it is pretty cool, I think. Let's try to get in focus. Can we get into the sun? That's better. Uh, it's better for you, but I can't see it on screen. Uh, let's try that way. There you go. What do you think of that, guys? That's pretty cool. I read this off an earring yourself. Yeah. Take it over. There you go. That's pretty cool, that's nice like that. Yeah. I don't think it's silver. Might be. No, I don't know. Well I'll, I'll give it a proper clean when we get home. Yeah, cool. I think that, the next, that's guys. the best find we've found all day. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, catch on the next one guys. Girls, Paul's got a target. And he's dug it out. And it's a cross of some sort. I wonder what the hell that is. Uh, Good signal. If anyone knows what that is, please leave a comment below. Uh, X marks the spot. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty cool, that Paul. Yeah, something different. Different. Well done, mate. On uh, to the next, guys. There you go, lad. And that's all we've got so far, guys. Uh, not much to show for. Couple of bullets, uh, couple of bits and bats. We're just waiting for no lad to turn up. Yeah, Paul's Paul mate. number two. Paul number two. Uh, he's only just started. But uh, you may see a video of him. He doesn't like having his face on video. And he found two silvers with me. Uh, on one of my last permissions. He's using a 300 eye, is it? Yeah, 300 eye. And he's got a proper Garrett pointer as well. Yeah. That pod. So, yeah, we're going to see Paul is going to come up here, uh, showing a couple of uh, hints and that. And... Right, guys, catch you on the next hole. Yeah, Bye for now. Bye for the next, guys. Boys and girls, we're having Bob Rill. <coughs> Bob Rill. <coughs> uh, just having a quick five minutes. Uh, Paul and <coughs> mate just turned up, so we've got to eat through him on the field now. So we're going to finish our bob reel up <laughs> and we'll catch you in a little while. Uh, excuse me for coughing as well. Yeah, uh, terrible at coughing. Alright, guys, catch you in a little bit. Boys and girls, Paul's got this find. Just after he's, dinner. He's just quite happy that he's found it. How do you see it was, Paul? It's getting on for. Six inch deep. Yeah, about six inches. And here we go. I do believe that's a spindle wheel. Uh, looks like it's got teeth. Put one way, well, take off a gas ob. It's lead. No, it's definitely lead that. But yeah, that's cut. pretty cool, that Paul. Um, My biggest spindle wheel yet. I'm 90% that's a spindle wheel. Yeah, I'm having it too. Alright, nice one Paul, well done. There we go, so getting older. Yeah, we're on a different field now. The old Paul's down there somewhere. So, yeah, I'm going to start this bit with Paul for a bit. Paul's oh. definitely, uh, he's definitely got it in him. Yep. Right guys, catch you on the next hole. On to the next. Gills, uh, dug the hole. And it's just right there. And I believe that is a musket ball. A very, very small one. Oh, hang on, guys. I think that might have been the point. Yep. Yeah. Oh, hang on. Let me just clean this up, guys. Right, guys, I'll give it a clean, and it's still got the nip on it. A little nipple bit. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. I like musket balls. Oh yep, you look at it that way. I'm going to turn it around. There you go. Yep, pretty cool that. 
All right, catch on the next one. Well, guys, we're back. Big Jim McCaskey again. Look at this, guys. That is a nice, really nice buckle. Oh, I said I broke the shank off. But yeah, like that for a buckle, guys. Cool, guys. Just turn it over, James, so I can see the side of it and that. Yeah. That is nice. And it's been a struggle, guys. It has, it's been really hard. I mean, spindle wheel, what, 10 minutes from this? Yeah. And them's about our best fans today. So, yeah. And Jim's only throwing the new pro pointer from <laughs> Garrett. <laughs> it was his little Christmas gift left by the Christmas, but he couldn't have opened it yet, should he, guys? Tell him off. So, yeah, guys, as of my Santa rant. Yeah, it's pretty cool, that. Yeah, let's get back to the nice buckle. Anyway, really? James. On to the next. On to the next. And uh, Paul's knocking about somewhere around right there. Down there. So, yeah, on to the next. Boys and girls, I'm on, we're on a different field. Uh, Paul's there. As you can see, there he is. Uh, yeah, just going on a different field and we have a coin. Right, it's just right there and that is a nice coin and just get a wipe there we go uh can't tell what it is let's get another wipe Not too sure. Can you tell what that is? Oh, it's definitely a coin. Definitely a coin. No, I've got a clue. No. But there you are. Well, there you are. Finally getting on the coins. I was going to try <coughs> down this bit. Not be on this field before, so. Hopefully we'll find something nice on this one. All right, we're going to shop Paul over. Yeah. All right, I'll catch you in a little oh. bit, guys. All right, boys and girls, got another target. And I think it might be a lead token. Oops. I'm not sure, but it could be a lead token. Or a lead button. It's one or the other. Alright guys, catch on the next one. Alright boys and girls, no target and we have another coin. Let's try and get in focus for you guys. Uh, let me give it a wipe. I'll get back to you once I wipe it. Alright guys, give it a wipe, but it's a toasty. Very toasty. As Rigsby once said, good night Vienna. <laughs> yeah, very toasty. Yeah, nothing we can get on that. Right, catch on next one. And boys and girls. Mm. <sighs> um. Hey, we don't know yet. Don't, I can see that's uh, <laughs> what it is. <laughs> Paul has beaten us all today. Uh, there you go, if you can see it. It's been very hard going. Up and slipping all over the place. Do you want to do the honours, Jim? No, I'll let you do the honours, mate. It's your coin, mate. And guess what, guys? We've no spit and polish today. Oh, wow. it's a shilling, I think. It's a shilling. Oh, 
It's a Vicky. Vicky, isn't it? Where is it, Eliza? It's a Vicky. A Vicky. And I think it's an old Vicky too. And just give it a wipe. We know we shouldn't be wiping it on yeah, pants. But we haven't brought our cloths out, we haven't brought spray out. Can you get a date, mate? And you want me to have a look? That's a big grin on his face. <laughs> Chilly. Let's see, can we get a date for you, mate? <laughs> I've not even got a torch on me. And I can see it. Can you? Yeah. Uh, you want to hold it? You know, let me just go check. Yeah. 18. 13. 18, 13. 13. That's what I can make out. Paul, 18, 13. That's the big granny face, guys. That's a big cheesy <laughs> grin. <laughs> well, so we dance, there you go. <laughs> and the shibby, the shibby, the silver shibby shuffle. <laughs> well done, mate, well done. It's been hard, grafty. It has been hard. Well done, mate. On to the next. Well done. Mate, I've got to yeah. test her how we shake hands. <laughs> well done, mate. Well done. Right, boys and girls, I've got a bit of an unusual find. Uh, I'm not too sure what it is. I bossed off a shield. Oh. Yeah, I'm not too sure what. Oops, dropped it again. Oh, I've got droppies. Yeah, I'm not too sure what it is, guys. But it's something. I'm happy with that. Right, catch you on the next one. Well, boys and girls, I just found this and we're not too sure. Just give us a minute, but just pause up a minute. Let me get my torch. Pause up and get a torch. We think it might be a pit token. But I don't know because it's got a lot of writing on it. If anyone can make that out, we'll see you better. Well, boys and girls, we finished. Paul's got his headlamp on. At last, <laughs> the time has come. Uh, it's it, getting dark. It is getting dark. Uh, so, we're going to do the roundup. Paul's going to be light man. And these are what Paul's found today. Uh, bit of a spoon, that crossy thing. Few bits, there's some nice bits there, Paul, really. Right, I'll show you my stuff now. Uh, that's around a round blank disc thing. That little pendant thing, I'll show you that in a minute. One, two, three coins. Uh, big marble I think. Uh, a buckle. This here, I think it might be a stylus, not 100% sure. Yeah, just cuff buttons. Uh, whatever that is. Uh, if anyone knows, please leave a comment below. Uh, Paul found that. Uh, I'm not sure what it is. Could be a chess piece, could be something. Uh, if anyone knows what there is, this is, please let us know in the comments where it could be off. Uh, uh, I think the best finds for today will be Paul's spindle wheel, uh, my little thingy bob, this here which we're not sure, I will look it up when I get home, and I think the best find for today for Paul is this absolutely gorgeous Elizabeth Vicky. Oh, is it a Vicky? It's a Vicky. Uh, yeah, he's right, it's a Vicky. And uh, if we can get the date. Yeah, 
I think it's 19. No, it'll be 18. Oh, eight. Oh, I got a date wrong. It's 18, 73 or 78. 1873. So, so yeah, and that's the best line for today. So yeah, thanks for watching. Been hard work. Please so give it all a thumbs up as you can see us. Definitely give it a thumbs up, guys. And we'll catch you in the new year. Yep, all the best. All Have the a best. good Christmas and a happy new year. Bye, guys.